And tornado-related repairs are still happening across the Miami Valley. Including at Brookville schools, which of course were heavily damaged by the tornadoes back in Memorial Day weekend. Two News reporter Juice Bertana shows us how far that district has come in its tornado recovery. The Brookville superintendent says there's still plenty of work to do here on campus, but they were able to complete enough to make sure students here start on time. If you would have asked me at the end of May, I didn't think there was any way that we would start on time. But three months later, the district has made great strides to start school on August 15th. The tornado took out the high school's roof, damaging much of the classrooms and interior of the high school. We have taken care of the critical path, and those were the items that we knew we had to get completed for a new school year to start. Most importantly, the roof. While a new roof now sits on top, construction crews are now working on outdoor repairs. Our land labs, our shelters, our ball diamonds, uh, those kind of areas, and a little bit of work still inside, but limited amount inside. Light posts will also be repaired soon. The total cost of repairs is estimated at $2 million. We actually had a very small deductible, and this most everything is covered by insurance. Superintendent Hopkins says it's a collaborative work of contractors, staff, and local businesses that's helped move things along quickly. There have been some long days, some extended hours, some nighttime work that's had to take place. Come Thursday, most of those long hours will be from studying students and teachers grading papers. And the superintendent says there's been an outpouring of support for students and teachers who might have lost some of their school supplies. He says they're making sure everyone is prepared for the start of the school year. In Brookville, Judith Hartana, 2 News, working for you.